Alright. All right. Here you go. I don't need change. Oh, well, thank you. Appreciate that. There you go. I forgot the cinnamon powder. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Yep. Bye bye. Ah, little coffee for the road. We are headed back to a job that we recently worked on. We did not fully meet our customers' expectations. And so we're going back. He just didn't think it was quite as shiny as it should be. We're gonna pad this floor, clean it, apply a couple more coats of, of uh, water-based finish, because we are determined to absolutely meet our customers' expectations. Dale, Paul Nelson. Hi, Paul, nice to meet you. Nice to finally meet you. Apparently, on that center logo, it was just a little lighter, not quite as shiny as what we'd hoped it would be. Sure. Okay. Yep. Well, we're going to fix that. Okay. So I had a mentor in the hardwood flooring business years ago when I was building a company out of Jackson Hole, Wyoming. This guy's name was Randy Nash. He built a large company in Boise, Idaho. There were times I would call Randy two or three times a week and say, Randy, what do I do about this? Randy, what do I do about that? And he always had an answer. He had good answers. And the answers that Randy gave me those years ago, are they still ring in my mind to this day. Randy told me that when you miss a customer's expectations, when you do a job and, and, and for whatever reason that doesn't live up to the customer's expectations, if you have the integrity to go back to that customer and fully make whatever corrections need to be made, to satisfy that customer, you will actually build more rapport with that customer than if you'd just done the job right in the first place. And, and don't get me wrong, our goal is always to just do the job correctly the first time. But once in a while, with lots of employees, and dozens and dozens and dozens of jobs throughout the course of a year, some of these expectations don't get met. And we will always go back and do everything we possibly can to fully meet our customers' expectations. We've whatever. done whatever it took to make another happy customer. For Western Sport Floors, Wyoming Wood Floors, this is Paul Nelson. You make it a great day.